friends, it's Ms. Miller here in the library, and this week I am coming to you to tell you all about the Caldecott Honor Medal. Last week we learned about the Caldecott Gold Winner, the winning medal. This week we're going to talk about the Honor Medal. Every year when um, the, the Committee of Librarians gets together to pick the Caldecott Winner, they also have the option of picking honor books. So they pick one gold medal winner, and then they can pick as many honor books as they want, and the honor books get the silver medal. Unlike other contests where they rank the winners, like, you know, in like in the Olympics, where the winner gets the gold and the second runner up gets the silver, and then the third place winner gets the bronze, in the library world, we don't do that. They pick the gold medal winner, and then they can pick as many honor books as they want, or they can pick no honor books if they want. So what that is telling everyone is that these books they think are the best best illustrated books that came out that year and these were like the finalists so last year the committee picked three different honor books the first one was bear came along and here's a sample of the illustrations and you can see it looks like the um, illustrator used a combination of different mediums some watercolor, some marker, some pen and ink to illustrate a really funny story about a bear. Double Bass Blues, illustrated by Rudy Gutierrez. These illustrations blow me away. And um, when I was doing some research for this video, I saw some pictures. These are actually paintings, and he paints big paintings, like bigger than the television set on your wall. So each of the two page spreads in this book envision them if you would when you look at them to be a giant painting and sometimes like the faces almost look like they're photographs but then other times they very much look like illustrations or almost like um, um, comic strip characters and uh, this book is really unique because there aren't a lot of words this, is, this uses the literary device called onomatopoeia where the word is the same as the sound for example on this page clap 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 the words equate the sounds and almost the whole book is told that way about a young boy who plays the double bass. And then Going Home with Daddy, illustrated by Daniel Minter. And in this case, Daniel Minter uses watercolor. And sometimes he uses, a, I'd say, almost say rather traditionally, like there's, you know, careful shading of the watercolor with the skin. But then other times in this picture, you can see he um, and almost uses it like a, he sponges it onto the page. And then sometimes he draws over the top of that with ink. And it's a lovely story about a, a family reunion. So this week for you, I have three different videos of recordings of read-alouds of the three different honor books from last year. So when you're done with this video, please click on those and then tell me which honor book you liked the best. All right. Take care, friends. See you next time.